Who of you would reach to the future? Like you, tomorrow, for breakfast, you may be taking a base like a biofuels. Is the energy drink to the future? In reality, you're already drinking it. Fundamentally, the whole world is changing. The political economic relationships between land, people, resources and food are being gobbled up by the grand plan. Giant oil companies, grain, are known genetic engineering corporations are forming powerful partnerships. ADM and Monsanto, Chevron and Volkswagen, BP, DuPont, and Toyota. These corporations are consolidating the research, production, processing, and distribution chains of their food and fuel systems under one colossal, industrial roof. The profound consequences of Israel create the industrial transformation of their industrialized food and fuel systems. The needs of the system will far exceed the agricultural capacities of the industrial north. Europe will need to plant 70% of its farmland to fuel its needs. U.S.S. entire corn and soy harvest will need to be processed as ethanol and biodiesel and still it wouldn't be enough. So the grand plan and the answers to the question you might ask. Are ag fuels clean and green? Of course they are, it's a scientific fact. Will ag fuels result in deforestation? Of course not, just look at the history of forests in this world. Will ag fuels bring rural development? Yes. The same way the industrial revolution did. Will ag fuels cause hunger? Of course not. There's too much food already. There is plenty to go around. Our better second generation ag fuels just around the corner. Yes, the second generation always is the more inventive, isn't it? Now, I've got a bridge in Brooklyn that you might be interested in.